Hi, my name's Adrian Rollins. Welcome to AMA TV. Today we're talking with Dr. Steve Hamilton, AMA President. Since the start of the year, it's been revealed that Medibank Private is trialling a scheme to give members cover for access to select GP services. What's the AMA's attitude to this idea? Well, look, uh, we, we, we certainly realise and the AMA recognises that there needs to be a uh, comprehensive, better engagement in the health system. We need to connect the primary care sector with the hospital sector. That's true for public hospital type patients, it's also true for private hospital patients. So we want to make sure that uh, whatever changes occur with Medicare locals, uh, there is a way of, of engaging general practice with the public hospitals. Similarly, the parallel in the private sector is that the, the private health insurers have a vested interest in making sure that they are connected to the primary health care service. At the moment, what we see is competing interests, diminishing the value of the GP, that's got to change. So there does need to be better integration. There does need to be a conversation about how that occurs. Some of these trials that are being proposed where public and private work together to assist GPs to manage chronic disease are positive. But there are other trials that the AMA is not so happy with. And one of those is where there appears to be uh, subsidies provided to facilitate bulk billing. The AMA has been a strong proponent that uh, the bulk bill rate is not sufficient to provide a quality service in general practice. And so selective support of bulk billing in general practice is one of the major concerns that uh, the AMA has raised. Uh, we do want to have further conversations with uh, private health insurers about constructive ways to engage with general practice, but they can't be selective, they can't be, uh, they can't be anti-competitive. Uh, they've got to be available to, to uh, build links between doctors and their regular, their, their regular patients uh, to make sure they, we strengthen that relationship, not diminish it. The AMA Council of General Practice has been considering this for a number of years and has got a paper which outlines the AMA position very clearly. And it does talk about uh, things that are uh, acceptable to the AMA that strengthen the health system and things that may diminish it. And uh, that's the major way we'll judge these potential trials. Uh, so some of them we like. This particular one does not uh, tick the boxes in a number of areas. And uh, it may well be that uh, it needs significant modification or it may not uh, proceed. 